Tyler and I both decided that having a doula would be good for us as a family. Jamie Hott's first experience with a doula was when her first child, Dominic, was born. Mary Newdorf, a certified doula, assisted Jamie during the labor. Jamie says having a doula for support was such a great experience. Now expecting their second child in June, she is looking forward to once again having Mary by her side. A doula is not the same as a midwife. We don't do anything medical, so we pretty much provide a physical comfort and support during labor um, and before labor too if they have questions, as well as information. It's quite a few different places that offer doula certification and training. Mine is done through Dona International, which is kind of one of the founding uh, trainers. They're based out of the States, but they train women all over the world. Um, so they have developed a scope of practice, standards of practice that as certified doulas we are required to follow. A doula isn't for just a first time mom. Jamie's been through this already and yeah. she called and wanted me to be there for their second baby as yeah. well. Just that extra female support was really important to me and somebody be there to be there to help my husband as well. Mary would squeeze my hips. Mary helped Jamie through contractions by pushing on her hips while she leaned over the counter. And it really, really helped. I've had clients who had the support of their partner and their mother, which are very emo good emotional support, whereas I'm a little distanced emotionally, so to see somebody in pain that you love is very, very hard. You're not sure how to help them. I see them in pain, but I know what's happening and I understand it, so I have an easier time dealing with it and helping them through it. It's, it's actually an adrenaline rush for me. I come home from a birth and I can't sleep. I don't, it doesn't matter if I've been up for 40 hours or not, I'm like high. Yeah. <laughs> like the whole process, the amazing, that a body can actually grow this little baby and birth it, and here it is, this little perfect tiny little human being. Leaving the hospital is not the end of the relationship between Mary and Jamie. Mary came and saw us when we were settled back at home, make sure everything was going good with like the breastfeeding and everything like that. There is actually postpartum doulas mm -hmm. as well. We do have a couple postpartum yeah. doulas in town. Having a doula was such a positive experience and I know this time that's why I wanted to have Mary again was she was just so supportive. I've had so many women who things haven't gone according to plan and they still have such a positive memory of their birth. And I think that's so important, that women have that positive memory. Yeah, it is important. If you want a doula, it is recommended to find one early in your pregnancy. We never know when the baby's gonna come, so I usually allow about two weeks either side of a due date where I'm kind of on call. And you can't really take too many women at the same time. And then we have a mentoring program too, so new doulas are usually assigned a more experienced doula. So if they're out of birth and they have a question, they can call because we all run our own businesses, even though we're a group together. But the group allows us to back each other up. To find out more, check out northpeacedoulagroup.com where you will find all the contact information as well as helpful resources. For Go Peace Country, I'm Diane Townsend.